Hello, my name is Jens Larsen from Copenhagen, Denmark. Um, I want to say a few words about this model, the Greek square. Um, we mention this model in the in the online course in session two or three. Uh, but I think it would be helpful to to uh, explore it a bit more. Uh, I'm Jens Larsen here in Copenhagen. I'm an entrepreneur. I'm a storytelling researcher and a coach, and I've been working with this protractic for the last 15 years uh, and helping people, organizations to create commitment and meaning through this concept. The Greek square is actually a model uh, which was developed by the, the great Danish philosopher Ole Fo Kirkeby, Kirkeby who who uh, uh, got aware of the protraptic concept back in around 2000. And um, in ancient Greek, uh, Ole, Ole talks about that there are these four core values or core concept, which, which, which everyone, which every, which every other values can 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 come back to somehow and if we know how to balance these four values the true just the beautiful good in our life in the organization in society we will experience freedom which mean flow freedom uh, creativity but it's important that we need to balance that we actually need to balance them when i was a kid i had a game uh, which was made out of wood well there was a small iron ball and and to manage uh, this ball through a kind of a, a field or something uh, i need to balance it and the same way it is about the Greek square, uh, you need to balance these four core values concept in your life and in society, in the organization. The true is science. You need to respect science. You need to be aware of science. What is, what is true uh, about this challenge? It can be the climate changes it can be the whole pandemic it can be inside your your organization something that you perhaps need to adjust and and then there's the justice uh, which is politics you need to have some law some politics that people find uh, uh, which is which is justice with people think, okay, this is this is okay, this is fine. Then we need to have good as a value, which is the ethics, which means that um, it is not about, it is not only about you, it is also about doing good for the people you are around. It can be your family, the organization, society, but it's, it's actually broader than that and we can say it's also about doing good for nature for all species somehow so true just a good and the fourth um, value universal value is the beautiful which which is art which is storytelling um, <clears throat> uh, which is fear at a, you can ask yourself, why is this important? Why is art important? Art is important because it creates meanings, meaning storytelling create meanings for us. And it creates visions and it create commitment. And it's a way to, to, to bring us together. And if we can be aware of these four 
values, universal value, we will, you will experience freedom in your life, in your organization, and in society. And why is that important? It is important because freedom uh, is a way to set yourself free, to set creativity free, and to uh, and to deal with a lot of challenges, which is a part of the world. So good to be aware of this, the Greek square, and you can also use it in coaching one to one and in uh, working with teams, etc. But we will talk more about that in the courses. Thank you.